Hey guys, this is Ron at Tales of Scales. We have some exciting news. Uh, we had some eggs, and as you can see, the first one has pipped open. You can see the little snoot, and then we have a little cut right here. So I usually wait until one or two of the eggs have cracked open before I kind of cut them. So now we're gonna go ahead and cut them open. You see a little bit of blood. Don't worry about it, that's normal. Um, the reason you cut them is because sometimes they can't quite get out of their eggs. So we're just gonna cut it open here and kind of see what we got. I'm not gonna pull them out, but you can see this is a little, looks like, I'm not sure what this one is. Go ahead and cut this one. So we'll go ahead and cut this one here. I've been waiting for these little guys to uh, hatch. They're a couple days late, which is another reason why I'm going to cut them open here. But uh, this is day 64, I do believe. But sometimes it takes a little while, but I always wait until the first ones kind of um, make their little pit first. Again, the blood is mostly normal. It's just little blood vessels that are on the egg itself. There's a little one you can see. Let's see what we got here. And then they'll pretty much sit in their egg for a couple of days, possibly. Sometimes they actually come out um, the very next day or later that day and uh, explore the new world. So I don't remember exactly who the dad was, but right now I'm thinking that it might be the the Mojave or the, the Mystic that I have. Wasn't even really expecting this batch. Hey little guy. That guy was eager to see the world. What we got here? Looks like a little pastel. And the last one. This one is another one. So these are the little guys that came to the world today. Kind of see, lots of variation. Um, I'll get pictures of them when they come out. And uh, if you can, like our videos, subscribe to our channel so that you can be notified when we have new arrivals or new exciting little babies being born. And we'll catch you later.